Legionnaire's disease is caused by a type of bacteria called Legionella. The bacteria got its name in 1976 when people at a Philadelphia convention of the American Legion suffered from an outbreak of the disease. Although this type of bacteria was around before 1976, more illness from Legionnaire's disease is being detected now. Each year between 8,000 and 18,000 people are hospitalized with Legionnaire's disease in the U.S. However, many infections are not diagnosed or reported, so this number may be higher. More illness is usually found in the summer and early fall, but can happen any time of the year. Legionnaire's disease can have symptoms like many other forms of pneumonia, so it can be hard to diagnose at first. Signs of the disease can include a high fever, chills, and a cough. Some people may also suffer from muscle aches and headaches. Chest x-rays are needed to find the pneumonia caused by the bacteria, and other tests can be done on phlegm as well as blood or urine to find evidence of the bacteria in the body. Symptoms usually begin 2 to 14 days after being exposed to the bacteria. A milder infection caused by the same type of Legionella bacteria is known as Pontiac fever. The symptoms of Pontiac fever usually last for 2 to 5 days and may also include fever, headaches, and muscle aches. However, there is no pneumonia. Symptoms go away on their own without treatment and without causing further problems. Legionnaire's disease can be very serious and can cause death in up to 5 to 30 percent of cases. Most cases can be treated successfully with antibiotics and healthy people usually recover from the infection. Legionella bacteria are found naturally in the environment, usually in water. The bacteria grow best in warm water, like the kind found in hot tubs, cooling towers, hot water tanks, large plumbing systems, or parts of the air conditioning systems of large buildings. People get Legionnaire's disease when they breathe in a mist or vapor that has been contaminated with the bacteria. The bacteria are not spread from person to person. Outbreaks are when two or more people become ill in the same place at about the same time, such as patients in a hospital. Hospital buildings have complex water systems, and many people in hospitals already have illnesses that increase their risk for Legionella infection. Other outbreaks have been linked to aerosol sources in the community, or with cruise ships and hotels, likely sources of the bacteria having come from whirlpool spas, cooling towers, and water used for drinking and bathing. These are just a few things to know about Legionnaire's disease and how to protect your family. For a list of indoor air quality professionals and resources, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ TV, the place to be.